Some of you are not going to like what I'm going to say this time, but please bear with me. We have big stuff to talk about here on the Tune Up. Hi, I'm Dr. Gary, and welcome to the Tune Up. Last time I talked a little bit about pivoting. Well, we're going to go farther with that right now. You know, I want you to hear what I'm going to say. Some of you may not like this. Some of you may think it's amazing. It doesn't matter. You got to hear what I'm going to say. Right now, many of you have written to me wanting to know what do we do about what's going on in the world right now? All the harm that's being done, some of the political games that are being played, some of the health games that are being played. What about the COVID thing? What about this? What about that? What do I do? And this seems to be the coming theme of many of the things we're going to be talking about here on the Tune Up. So let's get started right now. First of all, I'm going to ask all of you to take personal responsibility for what's going on out there. That's right, personal responsibility. Because till we own that we have a part of it, we're not going to be able to do anything with it. We have to admit and take a look at our own attitudes. We have to look at the way we're looking at things and how we feed into the nonsense. One of the things that's amazed me is how people have given up their control, their personal control, their personal rights, their personal ability to make choices and decisions and deferred it to a higher source or somebody that says they know what they're talking about, but they really don't. It's just their opinion but they surrender themselves because they haven't done their own homework. They haven't done their own reading, their own research to really find out what the heck's going on. Today, I want all of us to take a good hard look at ourselves. I want us to look at ourselves, our attitude about what's going on and not accept this anymore. First of all, here in the United States, especially here in America, and I know many of you that watch me are in Europe and around the world. In fact, I have more viewers overseas than I actually do here in the United States, which I think is profound itself. But all of us are human beings. And it's time for all of us to really own our humanity and understand many of the things going on in the world right now may seem out of our control, but they're not. There's a thing called mass consciousness. And mass consciousness is that magnetic impulse that we all broadcast off of our own bodies through infrared sources infrared energy, I should say, that allow us to have a lot of control about what goes on in our bubble. But our bubble connects to other people's bubbles. Now, this might sound kind of woo-woo or airy-fairy to some of you, but science dictates the fact that we are all connected through the ether, through frequencies, through the dynamics of thermal transduction that allows all of us to feel what other people feel. If you would just get your act together and start focusing on what you want and how you want the world to be and act as if it is that way and also do your own behaviors so you are someone that you want to be around, that other people want to be around, your energy is going to shift, your frequency is going to shift, and the effect you have on other people is going to shift. It may seem like we sit back when we vote in an election and have no control. What difference do I make? but each one of us make a tremendous difference. I want you all to take responsibility now for changing your attitude, for focusing on what's going on in the world and saying, you know what, I'm gonna change that. And we're gonna change it one of us at a time. The people that you're talking to today, understand you have influence on them. What you say matters. You may not think it matters, but it matters. People listen to you more than you think. People model you more than you may think they do. Be that person who is a leader. Be that person who stands up for themselves, stands up for humanity, stands up for human rights, and not allow other people to take them away from you or allow other people to take them away from anyone else by speaking up, saying something, not just gossiping about it, not just whining about it, do something about it. We can change all this very quickly if all of you will get on board. And I want you to understand that the big problems going on in the world right now are our problems. They're not for someone else to fix. We gotta start taking care of ourselves. 
we got to start paying attention to what we can do to make a difference, not wait for somebody else to make the difference for us, and then complain when they're not. Today, I want you to pivot. I want you to say, you know what? We're in a new world now. We're in a new way of making money. We're in a new way of thinking. We're in a new politics. We're in new behaviors. And these behaviors have got to change. We want to get back to civility. And what I want all of you to do, everyone that watches this tune-up, I want you to make a difference in someone's life today in a positive way. And when you hear someone complaining or bitching or griping about someone else, stop it. Tell them, if you have a problem with that other person, go talk to them. Work it out. Listen, all of us just want to be loved. Hell, that's all I want is to be loved. That's all you want. We want to be recognized and respected and understood. But the only way we're going to be understood is to communicate. I have people telling me all the time, they send text messages, they send emails to someone who reached out to them, and then they send a nice text back, and they never hear from them again. What is that about? It's time to reconnect. Reconnect and get on the phone. Talk to someone. Touch someone. Quit being afraid. Let them see your smile. Take off your mask and let them see your smile. I'm not talking about the medical mask. I'm talking about the mask we all have. You know that malaise that everything's okay, I'm fine? Well, let's stop it. Let's understand things aren't fine right now. Things are out of freaking control. We got to do something about it. And it's up to each one of us independently to do something now. Not tomorrow. Not one of these days. Well, I don't know if I like what Dr. Geary's saying. No. It's time for you to take responsibility and start making a difference right now in other people's lives. And be that example. Be that friend. Be that citizen. Be that civil humanitarian that you want to be around. Until next time, this is Dr. Gary asking you to challenge yourself now and quit blaming everyone else for the mess we're in and start saying, you know what, I'm going to change this, even if it's one person at a time. My job today is to inspire and motivate someone to be a better person. I love all of you. Please subscribe. Also, like and comment on this. I want to hear your comments. Also, give me your ideas, the things you want to talk about, and we'll talk about them. So until next time, this is Dr. Gary asking you to have an amazingly in control, influential day. And I love all of you. Thank you for participating. Till next time. Bye-bye.